Oh my god, she's whale on him. Berserker Barrage! <laughs> Yes, greetings my children. Today we are playing Sonic Smackdown, a Sonic fighting fan game. I kind of wanted to get into this like blind and play a little bit. I'll tell you one thing, this game looks pretty clean right about now. Bro, why you no work? But anyway, let's hop into this. I wanted to do a let's play because I felt if I did something informative, it would have probably taken me a lot of time that I didn't Bruh. have. I am not Maximilian, dude, but I can take a look at a fighting game that's Sonic related for sure. So let's try that. Also, I feel like I've been screaming into my mic as of late. Emoji! Let's go! This is illegal, you know. You see, I feel like Sonic games have always been set up to have like a lot of spin-offs, like Mario, for example. Um, Sonic has a couple of fighting games that existed in the past. One called Sonic the Fighters that dropped way, way, way back in the 90s. Uh, solid fighting game, but didn't get a lot of publicity. And then you have also Sonic Battle for the Game Boy Advance, which if you haven't seen my timeline on that, go check that out. Both are pretty solid fighters, but none were really like a fighter fighter. And I feel like the, the Sonic roster is so large. Just start putting those characters in a fighting game or a sports game, man. Sega's too scared to do anything with these characters these days. They're so one dimensional. All right, so we have our boy Sonic, of course. I will be starting with him. I'm sure he has like the bestest fighting kit to work with. Knuckles the Echidna, who I'm still waiting to be in Smash, or Eggman. All right, so we have Knuckles the Echidna, Miles, Tails, Perower, Shadow the Hedgehog, of course, Omega, Rouge the B -B Bats, Yeah, Cream and Cheese. If you guys remember Sonic Battle, she actually kicks ass in that game, so that's why I actually highlighted her for a bit. We will be using the Murder Master, Cream and Cheese. So that's why I say definitely support this. You can find it on Ichio for free. So we're gonna go ahead and start with Master of all Sonic games. Sonic the Hedgehog himself. Let's go with the standard color, bro. I really like the Super Sonic shade here, but let's go. We're gonna go with this. Sonic versus Metal Sonic. Shobuda. Sonic. Shobuda. All right, so I'm gonna start playing it like Street Fighter and see where we go from there. All right. Oh my goodness, already? All right, so. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. I love this, I love this. Okay. I'm fanning out because you can tell that they included like some of the Sonic Battle, some of the Sonic Battle uh, fighting moves in there, which I was hoping they would do for Super Smash, but Sakurai didn't have that time. <laughs> he doesn't have that type of time. Yes! Hold me attack him, I don't know, I have no idea what I'm doing. And your boy Mentok is victorious. I do love how rings are just flying everywhere. I wonder if there's any point to me collecting them. So you guys are aware, I am not the best at fighting games whatsoever. I will never call myself a fighter. I'll never enter those tournaments. Cause I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> but this game does make me look good while I'm playing. Trust me. We have destroyed Metal Sonic. Get him out of here. Put him in the trash, B. To be deleted? For something meant to be better than me in every way, you sure keep losing me, Metal. Strange, isn't it? This game's amazing for the soundtrack alone. Amy's had enough of my bullshit. She wants me to marry her and this is it. I've had enough of her stalking. Time to put her out of her misery. <laughs> oh my God. I'll tell you, man, Sega, you need to hire these guys. So the thing is like, this does remind me a little bit of Sonic the Fighters, but since Sonic the Fighters is a little bit old, uh, it doesn't have that fluidity and speed that a lot of fighting games have now. And of course, Sonic Battle, the limitations of the Game Boy Advance could only take that game so far. I think it's Sega, it's a no brainer. Like you have a whole cast. You could just even hire these guys to get it done for you. All right, I gotta pick like four characters for this video and just roll with it. And no, don't look back. I know they're gonna be people in the comments like, bro, why didn't you pick character X? Because I have only so much time to edit down. You know what I mean? Bruh. Oh! There we go. She's out. She's done, son. 
she fell through the floor, but I can forgive it. I can forgive it. Sorry, Amy. I've already got a date with Victory tonight. That's cold-blooded, Sonic. Jesus Christ. A fighting game is a no-brainer for Sega. Not only does all these characters have their own special abilities and like all these other things to work with, Sega's scared to use the characters because people used to complain all the time like, oh my God, there's so many characters in Sonic fighting games that um, we just want to play with Sonic, goddammit. And they took your advice and we've only been playing for Sonic for the last like 10 plus years, you know, like they're scared to put any other character to use in Sonic games to the point where they're just reusing classic Sonic over and over again. And that is the fans fault. They took the fan feedback. They said Sonic has too many friends and you guys are prioritizing friends too much. But we want some variety in gameplay. I mean, I would like some variety in gameplay. I would hope for a 30th anniversary game, they actually utilize at least like the main three, the big three or four, like Amy, Knuckles, Tails, and Sonic, you know? Oh, this is, this is definitely getting harder. <laughs> and that's what she said. So this map is actually based on the Silver's boss battle in Sonic Generations, which is based off of Crisis City from Sonic 06, if you guys wanted some background. Um, I do want to make a video about Silver as well. I want to go into his concept art and talk a little bit about what they were thinking when they were making the character. Silver has really redeemed himself over the years because he debuted in a game that everybody hates, aka Sonic 2006. So I do give it to Sega for giving the character a little bit of redemption. People want to see a little bit of more Silver. Um, they love his personality in in the comic, IDW comics, and he played a decent role in um, you know Sonic Forces. He put up a pretty decent fight with Infinite. It's too bad that plot was just dropped entirely. Get him. Yes. I am the best. I am the best. For someone from the future, you sure didn't see this result coming. Ooh, you never saw me coming. I'm sorry if my, my fighting style's not flashly. I'm trying to like get some of these combos off, but you know, at the end of the day, I'm just mashing buttons. As I said before, your boy is not Maximilian dude over here. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just trying to take a look at things. Let me see if I can do something fancy here. So the only thing I wish this game did have is like similar to Brawl. Um, where he can bust into a dash, of course. That was a dope finish. Uh, right now, he only has like a little step up that you guys probably see a couple of times when I've done it, but I want a full dash in there. I'm used to fighting other versions of myself at this point. You haven't gotten anything I haven't dealt with before. This, this Sonic is kind of spicy. Mecha Sonic. From Sonic the Hedgehog 3. And Knuckles, of course. So uh, this map is based on the Sky Sanctuary in Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles. If you guys are curious, like that game is probably my second favorite of the classics. My favorite being Sonic the Hedgehog 2. I'm one of those people, you know? Oh, your boy is a pro. We're comboing on him. The music is the final boss song. Mostly known as Big Arms, I think. That's what they call it. There's a really good um, remix of this song called uh, Big Arms for Sonic Generations 3DS. You may see me in one of the comment sections <laughs> for one of those uploads of that on YouTube. Oh! No! Ooh, I got KO'd. Okay, okay. The challenge is ramping up a little bit. They gotta fix that fall through the floor thing. Bust right into that combo. I need to start guarding more, actually. I know I'm like trying to combo all of my stuff, but this guy is not gonna go down easy. Clearly. Okay, Mecha Sonic, I see you. This is not gonna be easy. Oh, look! There's a grab, too. I don't know how I did it, but. All right, I gotta start. There we go. So what the rings do, I love that mechanic, by the way. So if you knock them out hard enough, rings will come flying out. And if you collect rings, some of your health that is red up at the top left of your bar will come back to you. 
So that is the purpose of the rings. All right, so here's a major test of strength, guys. Let's combo the frick out of Can I get a perfect? Can I? I spoke too soon. <laughs> now, I wonder if this game's actually completed. It. This seems like a fully fled, fleshed out game. I mean, they're not even charging for it. You can, because these are Sonic characters, so you can't charge for the IP. But at the same time, like, honestly, if Sega does not hire them to make their own freaking game, um, like, how far how far are they willing to take this? Oh, I need to be careful. Come on. Come on. Let's go. He's blocking everything I'm throwing at him. No! Oh, yes! Woo! Are there any other Metal Me's I should be aware of? I think that's what we need. We need a brand new Metal Sonic. <laughs> There's been so many renditions of it. We're overdue for a new one. I love these remixes. I wonder if these are strictly done for the video game too. If they were done for the game, I gotta commend them for like all the hard work that they put into because not only is it a full fighting game with its own unique mechanics and a huge roster of Sonic characters, they have all of these lovely remixes that are true to Sonic form. All right, I think we got him on the ropes now. Come on, Vector. Hey, hey. I love how Sonic does the the Chun Li kick. <laughs> that was almost too easy. Tell him. Talk to him. I'd like to think that Sonic just lost his freaking mind and he's just going after each of his friends one by one. I totally lost it this time, Shadow. You're going down. This is based off of the Space Colony arc. Um, level in Sonic Generations, which is based off the original Sonic and Shadow fight from Sonic Adventure 2. That is the remix you're hearing in the background. I love how fluid the combos are. I know I've said this before, but it's like... It's like really... Ooh, was that a bounce attack? And honestly, as much as I'd love to play with other characters right now, I'm actually fascinated with Sonic's moveset overall. Like, it's just really fun to play with. And, oh, he whips the guns out! They didn't forget. <laughs> so far, Mecco is actually the, the, the hardest to beat. Or maybe I'm just getting better. <laughs> they thought they could beat me, but they couldn't. <laughs> Shadow, you may be the ultimate life form, but <laughs> that was 50 years ago. <laughs> it's me now. You're dead. Mighty the Armadillo. Mighty looks a little off, but I'm okay with that. Mighty, by the way, was in the original Sonic the Fighters game. We are on the Pumpkin Hill stage with the Maroon Sal Marouge Saloon. Mirage Saloon, sorry. Mirage Saloon Act 2 of Sonic Mania music in the background. That's a remix. I really like that song, though. Oh, so he'll just straight up drop a rock on you? <laughs> I feel like it's more of a Knuckles thing, but I'll accept it. We don't know too much about Mighty's personality. You know, he hasn't been included in too many things. Shout out to him being in Sonic Mania, though. Some representation without taxation. That statement made no sense. Oh my god, what a cheap ass move, bro. Bro. Looks like I won after all. Horrible voice acting. Now, all we need is like a Marvel vs. Capcom's. Um, type of system where I get to switch out characters. That'd be dope. So you can play as the Sonic heroes. You know what I'm saying? Team Sonic, Team Dark. They're all in here. Why not, right? There it is. That's the win. So now we got our boy Eggman and I think we have one more character we need to fight. I'm wondering if it's the OC. But we'll find out. <laughs> well, this is familiar, isn't it? Go on back to some five-star sewer, you big drip. 
All right, Dr. Eggman. I believe Dr. Eggman was the second character that they programmed. Maybe it was probably Tails as well. But I remember seeing a very old build of this game, and it was Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, and I believe Eggman. Ooh, they got our old boy Dean Bristow's voice. No way. I can't believe this. So if you guys, I don't know how well it translates when, when you're not playing. He's not going to get away with this. But there's a lot of polish to this game. I'm seeing a few bugs here and there. But as far as the actual fighting, it holds up really well. One of the better... Sonic fan games I've seen, to be honest. So I'm not sure if they use like rubrics or like character models from like an, another game to model out these guys, but I can I can barely tell. And for instance, I like how they gave like Eggman's machine some limbs. Brawl, you could take a, I keep calling it Brawl. Super Smash could take a couple of pointers from the way that they implemented it. Because if you want limbs to like punch and stuff, just have the robot take that in, bro. I did a 24 hit combo. <laughs> I would love to see the Sonic game come out finally where Eggman and Sonic throw down like that. It's like, cake. Sonic, I'm so tired of this. I'm bringing out the fisticuffs. Another win for the good guys. Same time next week, Eggman. Ooh, Super Mecha Sonic. I wonder how this is gonna play out. He was the, I think he was the hardest person to fight so far, so. Oh, I don't like this already. I don't like this already. I wonder if this is a Super Mario Bros. Z reference. Oh my goodness. So what, if you're in the air the whole time, how am I supposed to hurt you? I guess this would be a good time to transform, right? Yeah, this is definitely Super Mario Bros. Z reference. If you guys haven't watched that flash animation, go ahead and check that out. So my guilty pleasures back in the day. Probably not guilty because I think everyone adored that flash animation. Whoever is into flash animation at the time. Yeah, it's gonna be one of those hard bosses. You ever, it's like a Tekken end boss. is ridiculous wow way to cheese your way through that oh and i had a full gauge too all right one second your boy will be back get him oh beautiful i loved it oh shit one more one more to go Guys, this is extremely difficult. I was hoping to fast forward and just like show me destroying him. This is like my fourth try at this. Holy shit, man. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. I should have done this on stream. I could have followed that up. That's one. That's one. One in the box. Men talk. Woo! Oh 
my god, I managed to do that. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna edit that, but that hey, I'm sure it's gonna look sexy. You have nothing to say to him? No shit talk? Oh god. Do I get anything for that? Congratulations. That's what they're gonna tell me. I adore this game, but god damn it, man. You could have given me like some confetti at least. Come on, yo. Oh, I love this song. Oh my god. Developers. Oh, oh god. You're gonna make a grown man cry. Um, how does it expect me to. I, I use that punching. Oh, there we go. I... Whoa. Okay, so I think he's a long ranger, right? So you gotta like drop traps and shit. Hey, yes, I love that. I adore that. So, of course, he's a more technical fighter. Uh, oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Hit him with a Mega Man beam. <laughs> Yo, I can see somebody trouncing me with tails like. So the newest character is Cream and Cheese. So this is the one that they released recently. I'm curious to see how that's gonna work out. So Emerald, Emerald is the one who came right before her. Um, so let's see how these two duke it out. Let's go ahead and do it in Club Rouge, which is a Sonic Battle map, which both of these characters appeared in. If you haven't seen my timeline for Sonic Battle, check that out. Oh, look, she has ear physics. All right, cool. Let's see. So it's like Rosalina and Luma from the get-go. Come on. Oh, it's amazing. Yes. Yes. Beat his ass cheese. Oh, my God. I feel like I can perfect this if I, if I tried hard enough. Good to see that Cream is still broken in everything that she's in. So she has her own little uh, fighting mechanics, but I think mostly you're gonna be using cream. I mean, sorry, cheese to defend yourself. But when people get in close, you just give the little judo slap right there. Like, did... <laughs> didn't even know what hit him. Oh my God, cheese. Whale on him. Berserker Barrage. <laughs> oh my gosh. Berserker Barrage. Cheese, get him. All right, so Sonic Smackdown devs, you gotta balance out cream, Bob. You gotta balance out cream. I can imagine this being a ridiculous, like, you'd never be able to touch her. That is Murder Master Cream and Cheese. Thank you so much for training with me, Emerald. Cheese and I will fight to protect everyone with you. And murder responsibly. So guys, that is indeed Sonic Smackdown. Feel free to check it out. It's free on Itch.io right now. Shout out to the developers who worked so hard on getting these movesets together and all these beautiful character designs. I love the art, the music, the whole approach is just a nice love letter to Sonic fans. Especially for me, who's itching to see the Sonic characters beat the shit out of each other. But aside from that, I'm out of here. Make sure to follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash thementalk. And as always, be safe. The Prophet. Have spoken. Come on.